Things are about to get good. The following contest is a fatal four-way Falls Count Anywhere match and is for the Cruiserweight Championship. Introducing the challenger from Phoenix, Arizona, weighing in at 130 pounds. Remember, guys, the title is on the line here in this one. And I don't remember the last time the champ was in this much jeopardy, Cole. Tonight might just be the night the title changes hands. He's been undergoing a lot of training for tonight, not taking this title opportunity lightly. Ah, this is gonna be fun, because here comes the Ninja Master, the Master of Martial Arts. And introducing the challenger, representing the from Kobe, Japan, weighing in at 156 pounds, Akira Tozawa! Akira Tozawa, so explosive inside the ring. <laughs> yeah, he possesses one of the best German suplexes you'll ever see. Tozawa hits hard and fast. As high intensity as they come. And we know when Tazawa is inside the ring, he is often full of surprises. Expect the unexpected with Akira Tazawa. The age of Alexander continues. And introducing the challenger from Charlotte, North Carolina, weighing in at 200 pounds, Cedric. Looks to me, Cedric Alexander sporting a more confident attitude than ever. Confidence well earned. Amazing high flying and striking skills on display when Cedric competes. Weak. Cedric Alexander, former cruiserweight champion, former Raw tag team champion. And listen, he's got a bright future. The Irish ace, ready for a fight. And introducing the champion, representing the Judgment Day, from Bray County, Wicklow, Ireland, weighing in at 180 pounds, the Cruiserweight Champion, J.D. McDonough! recently proven very difficult to beat because of his incredible threshold for pain. Does this guy not freak you out? I mean, he signed an NXT Championship contract in blood. Yeah, disturbing with a, a quiet intensity, right? Ferocious thoughts that will turn to disturbing actions. Yeah, those disturbing actions include dismantling the human body, utilizing pressure points, joint locks, and ligaments that can tear tendon from bone. Listen, he'll attack if he senses even the slightest fear or trepidation. Hey, J.D., J.D., fear and trepidation to my left. Look at Saxton. Quiet, Corey. The path doesn't matter. Here's where it counts. Here is where it's settled. The prize is on the line. Yeah. 
This is going to be some match. Remember, it's Falls Count Anywhere. No countouts, no disqualifications. Yeah, this match is so dangerous because anything can happen literally anywhere. It is all about taking care of business. The only thing the referee can do is look for a pinfall or a submission. The challenger doesn't even allow a one count. Don't know how he can't get more than a one count at this point. Ah, look at this. Taking aim on the arm. Right, pump handle, pump handle coming. Boom. Incredible suplex. Picked up, uh, back drop suplex. Oh, direct impact to the chest for the title. And he gets his shoulder up before the count. Able to get that shoulder up so quickly. What a statement. And we have Cedric Alexander. <laughs> Look at this. Oh, and a backbreaker. Right to the spine. Akira looking to embarrass his opponent. Oh, what a drop kick. On the mark. Crank in the head. Look at this. Snap suplex. The champ taking their share of hits now. Cranked around into a neck breaker. Brought back into the ring from the floor now. What's coming next? A back suplex. It. You and me both. Shades of the old EC Dub as a kendo stick is introduced to the proceedings. The amount of leg strength it takes to pull off such a maneuver is incredible. Going for a pin for the championship. Kick out at one for the challenger. So resilient. And he sends him to the corner. And oh, two ways of bat at that move was just dirty. And misses on the springboard. Continuing to attack the neck. Across the top rope. Setting it up. A brain buster. There's no way to exaggerate with a brain buster like that can do to you. And he has free reign to the outside with no count outs to worry about. Oh, nothing fancy with that boot. Oh, stinging kick. Debilitating attack on the leg. Close line. Answers with an inverted DDT. That can turn this around. Championship. Now the champ holds on. How in the world did he kick out? Boom. Head first. Those last hits rattled the champ. Yeah, this with the championship on the line. Throws the opposition back into the ring. Toss back into the ring. Right to the kidneys from behind. I don't know what they're looking for here. And when he's got that chair, you know he wants to send a serious message.
Dodged right on cue. And meanwhile, Akira Tozawa for the win. And the count stopped short of two. Giving a massive effort to overcome the pin attempt. What a forearm. Hooked him up. to get back inside. So much punishment has been absorbed by these men already. And yet, they are still going. Still ready for more. Oh, uh, this isn't going to be good. Got Buster. Across the shoulder. Filthy. He went right into that turnbuckle. level move. And he's taking this to the outside now. Sink one champion into the cover. There it is. J.D. McDonough wins and keeps the title around his waist. Here is your successful title defense for him tonight. 
A pretty impressive defense. 